Alright, so I've been wanting to make this video for quite a long time because a few months ago I kind of had like this weird revelation. So I'm going to talk about Cass's trench coat and I think it's kind of appropriate considering the season finale and what that means for Cass's character and his wardrobe very specifically because I am so excited for the fact that we are not going to see that freaking suit anymore and maybe Misha can get a costume change and I know for a fact that Misha's excited too considering he's complained about that suit at conventions before. So I know that the trench coat has become kind of this symbol for Cass. Um, clearly it's meant a lot in the show from, you know, Dean keeping it after the Leviathan possessed Cass and after he lost Cass and then giving it back to him and that kind of jogging Cass's memories. So clearly the coat has its own symbolic meaning in it kind of being what sets Cass apart and makes him himself, really. So here's the thing about angels. All of the angels that we've seen who have rebelled, meaning Anna, Gabriel, Balthazar, um, Samandriel, a few others, they all have some weird outfit, you know. Uh, Anna has her own clothes that she wore from her time as being a human. I don't know what the heck is up with Gabriel's clothes. Um, <laughs> Balthazar, I, again, I'm not sure what his fashion sense comes from, and Samandril, who's just kind of wearing the uniform that his vessel had on previously. But either way, they all have their kind of distinguishing look. Then you have the stereotypical douche nozzle angels, Zechariah, Raphael, um, Uriel, countless others who have lasted like an episode and then died. But either way, all of these angels wear suits. Very, very tailored suits, including Naomi, although hers is kind of a variant, which is odd to me because everyone else wore, you know, a black or gray plain suit. She's got kind of this really nice, clearly woman suit, whereas all of the other female angels have worn kind of more traditionally male or unisex suit. So anyway, obviously the suit has kind of represented the faithful angels, the ones who are still working um, for their own gain, and the more rebellious angels have more down-to-earth clothes. What is Cass wearing under the trench coat? A suit. So, in addition to being what we think of when we see Cass, the trench coat also serves as a barrier for what Cass could potentially become. If it weren't for that trench coat, he'd be just like all of the other angels. Which is particularly interesting considering that he's always kind of on the edge of being a good little soldier and the rebel that we see him as. That being said, we already know that Cass is going to have some costume changes in the new season because he just can't physically stay in the same suit if he's going to remain human. Which, for all I know, they could resolve this human thing really quick. When you think about how they handled Godsteel, yeah, this human thing could not last very long. But, again, he's going to need clothes if he's remaining human. And my hope for the new season is that the trench coat will be gone completely. Because then you have a new issue with that trench coat kind of covering his full rebellious state and acting very clearly as a security blanket which I don't think that Castile really needs to be holding on to the memory of what he was, because clearly that hasn't been working for him recently. Regardless, those are my reasons as to why I think the trench coat is great, and also why I would really love to see it dropped in the ninth season. Um, 